All right, welcome back, guys. You're with DBs. It's the road trip with DBs, except this time it's not a road trip. It's just a trip. I'm in the Bahamas currently on Abaco Island in a small town called Marsh Harbor. So I'm spending some time here. I'm going to explain to you why, how did I get here and everything, tour you around town and everything like that. So uh, uh, without further ado, let's do it. Oh, sexy girl. Oh, bah, danse. Oh, bah, danse. Que toi et moi, we run the world. So right behind me right now guys is the marina so what people do they just come here to park their boats and they um, they're just being rich basically so Abaco Island has the reputation of uh, being super cool for uh, doing all the stuff rich people do with their yachts so uh, they come and do that I have no idea what they do but I think they just uh, they just stay there and drink beer all day and they just live in large oh that's cool BMW one series hatchback it's pretty cool here there's a lot of uh, different cars some cars have the steering wheel on the right some cars have the steering wheel on the left but everybody drives on the left, it's super cool. There's no, uh, there's not one car that doesn't have a bump or a scratch here. So I would definitely, definitely not have a brand new car here, but it's okay. It's just the island lifestyle, man. People are just laid back. It's very cool. It's very different. You know, if you get mad at people for not signaling when they turn in Canada, don't come to the island, man, <laughs> because uh, needless to say that there's no shoppers, drug mart or anything like that. So it's, it's all like independent stuff. So it's pretty cool for that. Everything is super expensive because everything is imported, right? So it's a small island. There's about 700 islands in the Bahamas. Uh, everything is imported. Lots of things are private. Their currency is actually following the uh, United States currency. So whenever I withdraw through 100 bucks, it's, uh, it's taking 280 bucks from me. So uh, quite a bit of difference. 40 bucks every hundred dollar, but it's okay. You know, it's not too bad because uh, seriously, man, like whew, it's so freaking beautiful here. It's super hot. You're by the sea. It's amazing. The water is hot. I actually met a, a Jamaican girl. She was saying that <laughs> she's from Jamaica, obviously. And she was saying that she didn't like it here because it's too cold. It's too cold. I said, what? It's too cold for you? Let me take you to Quebec City where there's 15 feet of snow in front of everyone's yard. Come on, man. It ain't too cold here. It's just perfect. It's like always 26, 28. It's never like over the top, you know, it's just perfect, man. So I'm going to walk a little bit, go try. I'm going to try to go in uh, more like in the downtown. <laughs> There's like one traffic light in the whole town. Oh, and I think this is some car rental or something. There's a lot of Honda Fit. Everybody drives a Honda Fit because when you buy a car here, you actually have to pay, I think, 50% of the value of the car in taxes. Seriously, the Honda Fits are so popular. Look right there. There's like two and I look around. There's like a million thousands. I feel like I'm in the uh, when you're in GTA and like the, the freaking game like uh, has like a glitch and you see like the same car everywhere. Look at this car, it's pretty cool. I don't know what it is, but it's pretty cool. Anyway, enough talk about cars. We're gonna try to go in town, get some knowledge of the lifestyle of the Bahamian people. So this is the liquor store. Well, one of the liquor store, like a lot of liquor stores are just like, uh, they kind of look like convenience store. But this one is like the big ones. They say they're duty free, but I don't know about that, man. There's no six packs of beer here. They have a deal. It's always like three beers for six dollars or something like that. Yeah, that's the deal. So you do with it. And then a case, I think a case of uh, like 24 beers or something is like 50 US. So beer is pretty cheap. I mean, beer is pretty expensive. And so what I do, I just uh, drink rum. I get a 40 ounces of rum for nine dollar 25 US. That's my go to. So I just uh, get loaded on rum every night. So we're getting into town. Look at that. So that's what I like about uh, that's what I like about islands is all the buildings are always like turquoise or pink or beige or blue. It's very cool or yellow. That is very really nice. Yeah, so we're getting to the uh, only traffic light in the city. So I'm in the zone. So guys, you saw it first on DBs, on the trip with DBs in the Bahamas. This is the only known traffic light from DBs in Marsh Harbor. So enjoy. Up. Oh. Hello. Hi. How's it going? Hey. Ah, say hi to Canada. Hello, hello. Welcome <laughs> to Abaco. There you go. So nice this is Matthew, original gangster from here. Oh yeah. There you go. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, this, right. is to, this is the place to be. You know? There you go. Island life, man. Yeah, man. Okay, bro. Respect. All right, bro. All right, good to see you. Okay, man. I'm just making sure you straight. You know. Yeah, yeah, I am, yeah, man. Thanks a lot for stopping. All right then. Okay, bro. Drive okay, safe, eh? Okay. What's up, bro? How's it going? 
Rastafari. We're getting to the downtown where all the action is happening. Everybody's looking at me because I'm a white guy with a selfie stick. Oh, there's a guy from Alberta. <laughs> so yeah, guys, so here's the, uh, the uh, downtown. Oh yeah, it's happening. Holy guacamole, guys. I was actually just recording for 10 minutes and then it wasn't recording, so, oh. But anyway, that's the downtown, guys. That's, that's what it looks like. That's, that's kind of like around me. So I had, uh, after my trip to California, I had some, um, I had to go back to Calgary, Alberta to move out of my apartment. My lease was over uh, and I was planning to uh, go to Europe or Australia or something like that. But uh, unfortunately, that did not happen. Uh, some, uh, some changes in my life. I had uh, members of my family that were coming down here in the Bahamas that invited me. So uh, needless to say, it didn't take me long to accept the uh, opportunity. So I'm here for about six weeks. Really awesome. I mean, the, the, obviously the place is amazing. The views and everything. Right now we're in Marsh Harbor. It's about 40 minutes from where we live. We live uh, way down south. So it's uh, quite a ride. Uh, we don't come here every day. So that's why I thought about showing you guys. So yeah, we live around the, in a neighborhood called Bahama Palm Shores. I'm going to show you guys that later on. Maybe in this video, maybe not. So yeah, right now I'm going to meet my uncle, my aunt at the grocery store. One of the downside here is that uh, it's a small island. There's about 700 islands in the Bahamas. It's called Albaco Island. And uh, everything is, of course, imported. So everything is super expensive at the grocery store or anywhere else. Just like a pack of celery or whatever is like $6. So it's totally crazy. And yeah, so that's one of the downside. There's like two major grocery store here. Uh, and the rest are just, you know, corner store. And it's not a very big deal. It's a, it's a bien pour un mal. It's a con for a pro. You know what I'm saying? I don't know how you guys say it in English. This would be a fire station right behind me. And then, yeah, so I'm going to go uh, meet up my uncle, my aunt. So we are currently in the grocery store. Hello. This is my fabulous Hello. aunt. My fabulous aunt. Fabulous aunt. How are you doing today? Louise Bergeron. <laughs> Madame Bergeron. Yes, sir. I'm trying to pick the last bananas because right now there's about 10 bananas left on the shelf. Oh, yeah, we look at that. Any more bananas before so the stock Friday. is down. Like I said, everything <laughs> yes, is important. No bananas. There you go. This is Jan. And so what's happening here in Marsh Harbor? <laughs> Everybody knows DBs. And so I'll see you guys in a second. Take care. So can I interview you? Yeah, you can. Okay, so what's your name? My name's Shakara. Okay, what's the deal, Shakara? What do you do? Uh, nothing. She lives in a very beautiful place. Uh, I'm from Canada, so there's snow everywhere. Have you have you ever seen snow? No, I haven't. There's seen. like, do you know what snow I is? Yes. You know snow? Okay, there's like 15 feet of snow like in, oh, like in front snow. of everyone's yard at this time of the year. So this is uh, not something we're used to, but for you it's like normal. Yeah. But for me it's like beautiful. <laughs> How old are you? Alexandra. How old oh. are you? Seven. Seven? Oh. How old are you? <laughs> I'm 14. There it is guys, Abaco Island, Bahama Palm Shore. We got the, the great people here. And uh, that's a wrap. Thank you guys. Yeah. All right guys, so finally back in the neighborhood where I live. So it's called Bahama Palm Shore, south of the Abaco Island. Um, like you can see, beautiful, amazing view. So there's worse places than that to be in the world. Um, I wake up by that every morning. We're literally 30 seconds of uh, walking distance from the beach. So it's amazing. I go for jogs there in the afternoon and everything. So I'm really, really grateful to uh, be able to spend some time here um, this season. So I hope uh, I've shown you guys enough of the city and everything. I'll try to make a few more videos. And uh, for now, for today, that's a wrap. So you're with DBs. It's a trip with DBs. Bahamas, Abaco Island, Marsh Harbor, Bahama Palm Shore. Peace. <laughs>